all right boys you're looking at the new daily my audi broke down i have to order the parts so they won't be here for a week so we're riding the moped until the audi's fixed uh heading into work right now it's like six in the morning and uh gonna mop the moped i should got a full tank of gas baby so we ready this kickstart is breaking now like it's it's to the point where last time where it only engages like halfway down because the bushings like cracked there it goes There we go. Fixed the headlight last night. Get that good of a weld on it, so I'll probably have to go back and fix that as well. I'm gonna make my own mount for it because the one that comes with it just, just sucks. So. Some wheelies in the morning. I can't see a thing with the sun right in my face. Literally sounds so terrible, I keep hearing something fly out. Something is for sure loose on the pad. Every time I let off the gas, I hear something vibrating like crazy bad. Saved it. Oh. Yeah, look at that thing. That thing's pretty sick. It's summer now, so it's hot. And it's going to be like 110 on the way home today. It's like 6 in the morning. It's already 85 degrees. Oh, man. Way too steep. Hold on, buddy. remake my headlight bracket it already broke the problem is that like the actual part that goes to the headlight is aluminum and then the frame steel so they can't weld together but what I did was I welded the nut that steel um, that holds that bracket in to the front but you can barely get a big weld like attack it says this thing's all solid it just vibrates and cracks it loose every time no matter how much weld you put right there there's just not enough surface space so gonna have to make my own bracket when I get home but that sucks that thing's gonna be rattling Hopefully when I ride home it's not dark. Looser and looser. That thing's gonna fall out for sure. stretch right here for a wheelie. I 
didn't know how to switch lanes. I kept... Ah. All right, boys, 12 hours later, we're off the clock. It's time to get this ride home. Hopefully this thing starts. It's been sitting out here all day. Oh, man, my grip from the heat, the rubber just throttle grip. Oh, first kick, baby, let's go. Broken headlight still, almost forgot about that. I'll probably go home and make a bracket for that, actually. Good old knee stander. Can't see behind me right now. Woo, it's hot. That sun directly on you, bro. That is hot right now. I want to work on that uh, two stroke elite soon and get that thing running. I could probably get it running. Um, it's not going to get all the parts I want for it yet, but I'll get it running stock. A lot of people comment about the two stroke scooter and always tell me to get one. I have a two stroke scooter, I have the Honda Elite. 50cc two stroke. I just haven't started working on it yet. It's been the scooter I bought and put to the side for a future build. I just haven't had time or got started on it yet because I have so many other projects going. But uh, I plan on doing some cool stuff to that two stroke. Still not sure exactly what route I want to go. Whether I want to do a stunt scooter or make it slam. So uh, leave a comment below what you'd want to see with the two stroke scooter. Slam it or wheelie it. Also give me some ideas on what parts to get. Windy. What is that? I think my cooling fan just blew up, now that I think about it. Oh boy, there it is, look at Half my cooling fan is gone. That's what that noise is. All morning, I'm seeing this red orange stuff flying out the back. Exhaust about to break again, too. Exhaust a little loose, boy. Dude, that cooling fan is done. <laughs> Man, everybody who commented saying this orange eBay cooling fan was trash was not joking, bro. Look at this guy. <laughs> that thing is destroyed. Holy moly. Exhaust is loose. Headlights broken. Cooling fan's broken, I'm telling you, I can't ride this thing without breaking it, but, alright. I gotta put my stock cooling fan back on. I was about to put that on RJ's scooter, because his broke too, so I'm glad I didn't. But, oh, another piece just broke. Well, there goes another piece of it. Well, that's crazy. Hopefully this thing gets home without overheating, because I need to ride this thing to work for the next few days. Looks like I'm cruising home, boys. I feel like any scooter, when you're wheeling and jumping curbs and all that is gonna break, but hopefully when I build that Elite, it'll be a little bit more durable. All 
All right, I just fixed the moped. I just filmed it with my other video, so I didn't get any of it on the GoPro. But basically, the fan blew up inside of this side cover right here. I had an aftermarket eBay one or something. The thing blew up when I was on my ride home, and it shredded everywhere. And then my exhaust got loose and started breaking. And then my headlight was already broken. So went home, fixed the bracket on the headlight, welded a new bracket to the exhaust. So now the, bracket, the exhaust is literally rock solid. It sounds way better too. I don't know. I think I had an exhaust leak before because of the weight. It was opening the header maybe. But uh, also, I forgot about another part that was broken on the scooter just now. So my petcock, the bolt holding it to the frame was loose. So the petcock was aimed like straight up and the fuel from the fuel filter wasn't like getting fed in there properly. So when I was like top speed, it was bogging out. That's why. Found that out. Fixed that issue too. So scooter's feeling dialed right now. Ready to go. Ride it again. I gotta ride it again to work tomorrow, so I'll probably film that again. So, hit a few more wheelies and I'm done for the night. On that note, I'm calling it a night and I'll see you guys in the next one.